Happy Saturday. Welcome to Learn the Culture, Live with the Heritage, Give Hope to the Local Communities. Currently, I'm situated at the older side of the Kuala Lumpur by the name of Sin Se Siya Temple. So Sin Se Siya Temple just newly awarded as National Heritage Sites. And when we heard about the word temple, we will associate to the word spiritual, religious, and come into our mind is chanting and praying, right? So today I would like to bring you some attention that is not about just only that. So importantly, they create a lot of job titles because in religious business is so important that such as like Jolene next to me. So what is she doing? She's arranging the paper to you is a paper. So can I have one? Thank you, Jolene. Jolene has been working in this temple since at the age of 20s and today she's almost like getting 40. Yeah? So to you, it's just a piece of paper. But in actual fact, can you see here is a gold painted and you also have another piece is a silver, silver painted. Yeah, silver painted. And what is this? Because in Taoism, because this is a Taoism temple, in Taoism, very important is the philosophy is give and take. So when we pray or when we chant, we want to ask from the deity. So that is something like we wish to take. But before you actually able to take, you must learn to give. So why we have offering tools? Because that is a symbolic of giving. And I would like to bring you to another interesting country is the name of Myanmar and I'm going to show you a very unique village because the whole village is working hard to make a worshipping tool so so that is the name of Go Li Myanmar the former name is Burma so when we heard about this country, we often get to know is like Yangon and today the capital is Napito. But there is a very interesting city by the name Mandalay. It's situated at the north. So Mandalay is very famous with Buddhism religion and also they have many beautiful pagoda surrounding. You can see a lot of nice temples an aesthetic design of Buddha statue in this country and especially in Mandalay. Behind this art, there are heroes who are contribute their energy and sweat to create and complete this masterpiece. Making these arts is not an easy task at all. Let's start with the making of the gold leaf, also known as Suisai which to be gilt on the Buddha image or stupa. Despite the hardship and difficulties of the work, they remain doing it because for them, this is the opportunities for them to support their livelihood. Apart from related only praying and chanting, the spiritual actually promote SDG 1, no poverty, SDG 8, decent work and economic growth, SDG 9, peace and justice, strong institution. Most of people might see spiritual as only religious thing. However, it is actually play a huge role in promoting understanding in humanity. The job opportunities provide from the spiritual activity actually not limited for the devotee of the religious only, but it is also open for everyone despite their different belief. When I met Madam Lani, I was surprised how as a Sikh and they have their own belief and she is choosing to work in the Taoism temple. And it made me realize that the job opportunities provide from the spiritual activity actually not limited for the devotee of the religious only, but it is also open for everyone despite their different belief. It is all about respect each other. So this is the best lesson learning. <music> 